For our last story, let me ask you a question. Do you know what is the most searched question about our universe? It is this one. What are black holes? It's a mystery that has haunted mankind for ages. And the more we know, the more there is to know. So this new year, India has launched a new space mission. It will study black holes. It's the second such space mission of its nature. The first one was launched in 2021 by NASA. And this isn't ISRO's only mission this year. It's just the beginning, in fact. It has several missions lined up, including test flights for its first manned mission called Gaganyaan. Our next report tells you more. 2023 was a year of many things. The year of two wars, the year of artificial intelligence, the year of weight loss drugs. But for India, 2023 was a little extra special. It's the year we went to the moon. 2023 was all about the success of India's moon landing. And it looks like 2024 has more lined up, like ISRO's ExpoSat. It's an X-ray polarimeter satellite. ExpoSat launched on Monday from the Sriharikota spaceport. It's a rocket that's carrying an observatory. What will it do? It will study black holes. The mission costs around $30 million. It's the second of its kind in the world. The first was in 2021. It was by NASA. India is launching its own now, and it's to understand how black holes work. And it's important too, because black holes are one of the most fascinating objects in space. They have intense gravity, so much so that neither matter nor light can escape it. Scientists believe they are formed when a massive star dies, as in it collapses under its own gravity. The star becomes so dense that it wraps the fabric of space and time, turning into what we know as black holes. That said, there's often a common misconception, and it's that black holes suck things in. They don't. Black holes are just like any other thing in space. In fact, you can get surprisingly close to it, like a few hundred kilometers almost. For example, if you replace the sun we know with a black hole, our Earth won't get sucked into it. Neither will any other planet. They will just continue revolving as they are now. But black holes are still challenging to study. That's because they are virtually unseeable, which makes India's mission an ambitious one. It's also very crucial. We know what black holes are, but we don't know its origin story. Also, could studying them unlock the secrets of the universe, a.k.a. what the beginning of time looked like? So, black holes can unlock a lot of puzzles about the universe's existence, about how they came into being, about why they are different in size. So, studying them is an important mission. But it isn't India's only mission in 2024. There are 12 of them. And a crucial one is Gaganyaan-1. It is India's manned mission to take astronauts into space in 2025. And the test flight could be in the first quarter of 2024. Then there is Mangalyaan-2, India's sequel to its first successful Mars mission. There's also Shukrayaan-1, a spacecraft which will orbit Venus for five years. So it'll be a busy year for India's space agency. Last year, we aimed for the moon. This year, we are aiming further.